King County continues with a $1,000 refund check for SE&G customers. As News Channel 6's Stephanie Borman tells us, the $14 billion deal from Dominion Energy to buy the private company behind the failed VC summer nuclear expansion project could end up ending up putting money in your pocket. Last summer, work on Reactor 2 and 3 came to a halt when Scana and Santee Cooper pulled the plug on VC Summer, and customers were left with a $9 billion burden. But a deal from Dominion Energy to absorb Scana, which is the parent company of SCE&G, could save the project and put money back in your pocket. So within 90 days of the close, Dominion Energy plans to provide a cash payment to all the SCE&G electric customers across South Carolina. Right off the bat, $1.3 billion will be refunded to customers. That means the average homeowner with a $150 electric bill would get a check for around $1,000. So that's not just your residential customers, that's your churches, that's municipalities, that's small business and, and major industrial customers as well. As part of its proposal, Dominion Energy will also put some cash down on the failed nuclear expansion debt. That means electric bills will be cut by 7% or around 10 bucks for the average customer. The company also plans to pay off VC Summers in 20 years versus the original plan to do it over the course of 60. And then after year eight, rates will continue to decline until VC Summer 2 and 3 are fully paid off. Still, lawmakers have a lot to consider with this proposal from Dominion Energy. Despite the refunds and rate cuts, as News Channel 6 previously reported, the average customer would end up paying nearly $4,000 over the course of 20 years to fund the reactors. There's a lot of different scenarios that are out there that are being looked at in a way to try to protect the ratepayers. In Aiken, Stephanie Borman, WJBF News Channel 6. If the merger is approved, it could happen by the end of the year. Customers, you'd get your refund within 90 days of the closing.